Hi all, welcome to another video tutorial of uh, easy way to automation. So today we are going to see how can we read uh, request uh, payload from JSON file and uh, how can we update uh, those values in Karate framework. So as of now, we were uh, providing request payload in the feature file itself or we used to create a JSON object and we used to add values and we used to create a request payload. What if I want to fetch a request payload from an external data source file and in this case that external data source file is a JSON file. Let's quickly jump to IntelliJ. So we have this uh, feature add book details so we will change uh, in this feature file so that you will get to know how can we uh, fetch the request payload from a json file if you see here actually uh, i had created a json object named uh, by request payload and i used to provide uh, the values such as ID, title, description, page count, excerpt, and uh, published date. So quickly what I will do, I will create a package and I will name it as uh, test data. New, then I will uh, click here package and I will name it as test data and here I will create a JSON file so I will name it as uh, uh, create book dot JSON ok and if I go to this website right fakerestapi.azurewebsites.net and this is our uh, post request right and uh, this is the request payload which we have to give so I'll copy this request payload and I'll paste it over here in the JSON file okay so if you see this is the template okay we have to read this template and we have to update uh, all these values or say like uh, the keys such as ID, title, description, page count, excerpt and published date. So what I will do, I will delete everything from here, okay. It's not required at all as we are going to read it from a JSON file, okay. So, we have one uh, method available in Karate framework uh, to read uh, the JSON file that is called as read, okay. And here actually we have to provide uh, the path where our JSON file is located. But we have to give the path with res reference to uh, the current feature file, okay. If you see our current feature file, uh, is present inside com.karate.features package, right? So what I have to do is I just have to uh, go back to com.karate. After that, I have to go to test data and inside test data, I have my JSON file, okay? So for that, what I have to do is I just have to um, write here dot dot slash so that it will go to its parent folder okay that means uh, our feature file is present inside features so that it will go back to its parent folder which is like com dot karate okay so after that i can write test data okay and we have create book 
dot json okay but uh, if you keep your json file wherever your feature file is located then directly you can give your uh, json file name okay but as i have created a separate folder uh, named by test data okay so i had to go back to the parent folder then i have to go here right test data and inside this my json file is located okay so now we have uh, read uh, the request uh, payload okay so we have already read it so now what we have to do is we just have to provide uh, the values or say like update the values so for that what we can do here is so i'll just write here okay then we have something called as uh, set okay so we can write request payload dot id okay so we have to uh, set the id so i can give any id say like nine eight seven three okay then we have other values as well title so i can give here a star set request payload dot title equal to i can give karate api automation okay uh, then i can write star set request payload dot description description i can write uh, same thing a useful tool for api automation okay a useful tool for api automation what else we need to provide we have to provide page count so i can write here same thing i'll just copy i'll just give your page count and i'll just mention say any number 130 then we have to provide excerpt so i will leave it as it is so it has to be tool then we have this public state right so i'll just copy it and paste it over here okay and this has to be your public state okay and i'll give the current system date okay it is already there okay so or else uh, you don't have to set it because it is already there right you don't have to set it we will only set all these values okay id title description page count and excerpt okay after that i'll just write here um, uh, star print request payload okay so let's just uh, check okay whether we are uh, getting all these values or not okay so i have applied one breakpoint over here so we will just check whether we are able to read our um, json file successfully or not okay so i'll quickly go to junit uh, runner test okay and here i'll just change the feature file name 
add book details okay so i'll just uh, save it So we are getting some error. So I am just trying to resolve the dependencies. Okay. So I restarted uh, my Eclipse and uh, whatever errors uh, I was getting. So all those errors are gone. So let's quickly run our add uh, book details dot feature file. Okay. So all I have to do is I just have to run this uh, J unit runner test. So let's run it. It is now executing our test scenario. Okay, so our scenario executed successfully. Let me just uh, go to karate summary.html. I will uh, launch this HTML report. So if you see, if I click here, right, see it has uh, read our uh, JSON file and it has updated also whatever information we had given, right? and uh, let's go to post method so if you see um, so this is our request payload okay and uh, this is the response what we have got so if you have a json file directly you can uh, fetch the request payload and you can uh, update the values okay or the keys using uh, set keyword i hope you found this video useful if you like this video please like comment and subscribe to my youtube channel thank you for watching